Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. It is a little after five and I'm out for my third hunt of 2022. Um, for those of you that saw, saw a couple weeks ago, I smoked a doe, which unlocked uh, my second buck tag for here in Indiana. And uh, two weeks ago, my son shot him a buck. So um, right now, it's not the coolest of weathers. I think it's uh, 69 right now. It was uh, 78 yesterday. Tomorrow, it's supposed to be in the uh, high 50s. There's cold front pushing through tonight. It's supposed to bring some rain. So sitting over this. Uh, Hay field to my backside here. And on this side, we got uh, a pick bean field. So the bucks should start to cruise anytime. The wind is kind of marginal right now. Uh, <coughs> something does come out. Hopefully, it uh, will come out close enough to this row that my wind goes over the top of them. Anything that comes out of this bean field will be fine. Could have probably set in on the, on the uh, creek and uh, had the wind dead in my face. But the problem with that is, is uh, just don't see much in there. So um, I got the uh, nose jammer on right now. It seems to have had one encounter with a deer with it on before, and it seemed to really help. Um, got the grunt tube. Got the grunt tube. Got the rattle bag. Of course, got the bow with me. So, I'll sit here and give about, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes, and then I'll start calling light rattling so today's the 18th yeah I believe it's day 18th today so anytime now these bucks should start really cruising um, looking for the first does to come in heat so I'm gonna get quiet and uh Birds are pretty active today, so maybe that's a good sign. So who knows? We'll see. <clears throat> got about an hour left. So this is about the time of night. Just when the sun's starting to go down. Of course, there's no sun today. I like to start rattling and calling. And now, uh, call, I just got a slide tube call here, so it does everything from a fawn to a dominant buck. <clears throat> I don't try to sound like the biggest buck out of here. I, I try to sound like a just a small, medium-sized buck, maybe a two-year-old. So when I start, I just hit. Normally three grunts. And then I give it, I give it a few seconds, maybe five, six seconds. Wait, 
15 seconds, 10 to 15 seconds, and you'll get either your rattling horns, your pack rack, your bag, whatever you use to rattle. start off kind of light in the early season peak rut I go real heavy and then post rut I go back real light Don't rush it. Remember, this isn't a big knockout, drag out fight you're trying to imitate. What you're trying to imitate is just two bucks see each other and they're just testing each other out right now. They're not really, you know, there's not a buck locked on our dough right now. So you're just trying to imitate like two, two bucks out here just filling each other out. And it's starting to rain. And then in between it, throw some grunts in there. Okay, so do what I like to do is I do that for about, I don't know, 45 seconds to a minute with the grunts and the rattling. Then I stop and I'll wait 15 to 20 minutes and I'll pick it up and do it again. And I'll do that all the way until the you know, last part of legal light and then, then you're done. Nothing comes out. There ain't no sense of doing it right at legal light because you can't, you know, you can't take that shot anyway. So, um, I'm gonna sit here, see if something responds to the rattling and calling.
six out so far in the beans. One's a small bug. Oh, I got a couple more coming out right now. Sometimes it's small ones, but either way it's fun, so I'll check out you guys next time.